There's a reason that that bullet hit my child because he had to bring all of you together and let you know that there is a way that we can stop this. A community consumed with grief tonight and a family's heartbroken plea after their 15-year-old was shot and killed by an 11-year-old friend. This unthinkable tragedy has shaken a North Nashville neighborhood to its core, and tonight they gather to remember that 15-year-old boy, Devontae Ziegler. Our Chris Conti is there, and what's remarkable, Chris, is the family isn't blaming the young child who pulled the trigger. Yeah, they aren't, Rory. Even though police charged that 11-year-old boy with murder over the weekend, tonight, Devontae's family did their best to try and prevent something like this from happening again. How are you doing? Hey, hey. Amelia Griswold has no children of her own. And these kids put all of this together. And yet the grief this woman is experiencing right now is that of a mother who has just lost her only son. <laughs> she had no soapbox or microphone. I would like to thank all of you for coming. Her stage on this dreary Monday night was a cold concrete sidewalk on the edge of a heartbroken North Nashville neighborhood. You're going to be the voice of Devontae. Devontae's voice is going to speak through you all because you can reach more young people than I can. Devontae Ziegler was 15 years old. He died on Friday after being shot by his 11-year-old friend. This has hurt me. This has tore my whole heart out because my baby's gone. Amelia was his aunt. Mom, though, is the more appropriate title for someone who raised a child from birth. I never want another mother to go through what I am going through. It doesn't make any sense. Two families torn apart by one bullet. A young people's dying. Senseless. There's a reason that that bullet hit my child because he had to bring all of you together and let you know that there is a way that we can stop this. We have to stop killing our young people. Devante may not have technically been her son. I was talking to him that day. You were. But her heart is broken, just the same. Speak for my baby. Don't let his death be in vain. Powerful message there. Still the biggest lingering question in all of this. Where did that 11-year-old get a hold of a gun? Police are still working to determine that answer tonight, Rory. She's so brave. Yep. That moment. Incredibly. So, Chris, thanks. The 11-year-old suspect charged with Devante's death was released from juvenile detention today after his hearing was canceled. Another hearing has been scheduled for April 13th. Police do not think the child intended to shoot his friend, but he did act suspiciously Friday night. That's why they charged him with homicide.